Being able to get outside and enjoy San Diego's weather is a big reason why people live here. But according to a study by the San Diego Foundation, not everyone in the county has equal access to parks. Audra Stafford is live in San Isidro with the program that's opening the outdoors to dozens of South Bay children. Audra. Good morning. Yes, I'm here at the San Ysidro uh, Civic Center, and this is where the Opening the Outdoors Camp is being taking place all week long. It's a great program. This is the first year of the camp, but the program's been around for a while. I want to bring in Lisa Cuestas with Casa Familia. You are hosting the camp, right. and what are kids doing here this week? So we have 100 low-income students that are getting outdoors. They're having fun. They're doing lots of activities. They're spending most of their time outside, but they're doing everything from robotics to arts and crafts to learning about nature and having fun. They'll be doing uh, uh, field trips, going on scavenger hunts. They're learning about safety when you're making a fire, making pretend fire so that everything stays safe, especially since it's so hot. But some perks about the program is that they're all getting um, kind of homemade, we have a kitchen here, homemade fresh meals by our health advocates who are volunteers of Casa Familiar. Wonderful. They'll be benefiting from new books by the end of the week and, and they're all making new friends and they're all, um, all local students from here in San Isidro. That sounds like a, just such a fantastic program and you can see a lot of activity going on behind us right now. The kids aren't going to get here for another hour, hour and a half or so, but they've got t-shirts for them, bags, they're just kind of getting set up right now. Why is this camp so important uh, down here in the South Bay especially? Well, I think it's an example of somebody like San Diego Foundation supporting local organizations like Casa Familiar and Girl Scouts and putting their their best foot forward to bring something very positive into the community. We have 100 kids, we have girls showing leadership and being like peer mentors to other students and at the same time the, the smaller ones are, are engaging with each other in a, in a fun environment and, and learning about environment and environmental um, you know, awareness and why it's important to keep the planet clean. Wonderful, and we have one of those campers here. She's an early bird today. Leela, I just want to ask you, because you were here yesterday, how was it, and what did you guys do? It was good, and um, yesterday we learned about fire, and we made fire, and but it was made out of candy, and we learned about nature, how they were alike and different. Really cool. Well, have fun this week, and we'll be talking to you some more throughout the morning. I'll let you get back to work. Again, the camp taking place all week long here in San Isidro. I'll send it back to you guys. So they learned how to make a pretend fire out of candy. i got to get the recipe for that one. <laughs> I know. I'll, I'll ask her for that. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Audra.